Hello viewers, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to discuss about solvent effect which is used in electronic transitions. Now I am ready to discuss about electronic transition or how can interact a solvent in electronic transition. This is the simple, I am explaining only three points. What are the three points? Before seeing the three points, if you are new onto this channel, please subscribe. If you are regular viewers means Please share to others after the end of the video. From the beginning onwards, each and every video I am telling, if you are new onto this channel, please subscribe. After, then share to others after the end of the video. Then, once again I welcome to my Time Pass Comes YouTube channel. Solvent effect. What is meant by solvent effect? How can you interact with solvent in electronic transition? Usually, Usually, solvents classify into two types. One is polar solvent, another one is non-polar solvents. Some ab absorption species also classified in two types. One is polar absorption species and another one is non-polar absorption species. The polarity of the solvent, the polarity of the solvent has significant influence in the electronic transitions. Usually, the non-polar solvents, for example, alcohol then xn these two are suppose non-polar compounds maximum absorption gives an alcohol and uh, as well as uh, non-polar uh, for example xn but uh, polar compounds but polar compounds having some significant effect other some significant effect in the electronic transitions for example if the sample, sample means substance, if the absorbing substance is non-polar, if the absorbing substance is non-polar, the effect of the solvent is mainly determined by the RA of the solvent, R. For polar and ionic light absorption species in polar solvents, for polar and Ionic light absorbing species in polar solvents having the dipole movement of the solvents main responsible. So in the first case for non-polar absorption, if it is non-polar absorption species, mainly determine the array of the solvent. But in the case of polar substance or ionic substance, dipole movement of the solvent is mainly responsible for the, in the electronic transitions. Usually, we have three reasons, three types of explanations. That means three types of explanations. The first explanation is pi to pi to transition. Pi to pi to transition is very intense. Not only that, it has bathogramic or red, si red side shift. That's it. That is also called to be red shift or bathogramic shift or intense shift. This is said to be pi to pi star transition. For example, most of the transitions occurs in excited state than in the ground state. In, the, in this case of pi to pi star transition, this intense absorption having most of the transitions occur in the excited state than in the ground state. Not only then, pi to pi star transition commonly visualized in balanced bond terms with the ground state represented without charge separation and the excited state as dipolar species. Then, then I want to explain N2 pi star transitions. This is the very less intense absorption. This less intense absorption mostly the ground state is more polar as compared to the excited state the ground state is more polar when compared to the excited state. In the case of pi to pi, to, pi star transition, the excited state is more polar than in the ground state. But in the case of N2 pi star transition, having ground state is more polar as compared to the excited state. The hydrogen bonding with the solvent molecules takes place in lesser reactant with the carbonyl group in the excited state. The weak transition state of the oxygen lone pair in ketones during N2 pi star transition 
shows a solvent effect in opposite direction. The third case n2 by trans n2 pi star transition. The transition is also very sensitive in hydrogen bonding. Alcohols, amines can form hydrogen bonding with the solvent molecules. Such type of associations may occur or may not occur. But non-bonding electrons in the heteroatom, thus transition is greater energy. Transition in greater energy. Some of the transitions having little effect or little significance in the electronic solvents. Usually, non-polar solvents gives same absorption, both the case of the alcohol and also exane. Exane may be non-polar solvent. Only polar solvents give some significance in the UV transitions. This is the solvent effect in UV transitions or electronic transitions. If you are understand means, please share to others. If you need that, if you have any doubt, ask, ask via comment section, then I will answer you. Okay, thank you.